Yeah, what I'm going to do, I found that my ward softener has um, basically it stopped, the flow has stopped. So I couldn't find anything about a Culligan one, but this is, a, a, I've had it 13 years. And it's all been good, apart from the brain blew up once. But um, what I've done, I, I'm going to salvage most of all this, because it's all good. Cleared that out by hand. As you can see in there, that's all sludge. And I've got a trowel in there. I'm going to clear that out and throw it away. And I'm assuming, I'm assuming it's all blocked up the suck up tube that goes into the tank. Because all this gunge. It's obviously gunged up somewhere because I put the bypass valve on and the shower works fine there, plenty of pressure. But there's hardly anything coming out of the shower, so something's blocked. And I only assume it's a pickup. So um, I'm going to clear all this out. Then I'm going to um, do something a bit radical and chuck uh, some caustic soda in there and regenerate and see if that does anything and clears out the tank. Yeah, you can see, <coughs> you see the dirty stuff. Some of it's okay, so I'll salvage some, but you can see like the black, or like dirty sediment stuff, so I won't keep any of that. And as I said, I'm gonna try and clean around this, because that's the pickup, and that sucks it up into the tank. But first of all, I had to put the bypass valve on under the sink. There's a valve which um, you turn and it allows it just not to go through the system anymore. Um, but so I still need to clear all this out. Right, yeah, see, that's what I want to get to. See there. And there, I've got this big screw driver. There, it's all blocked. There, look. So I can clear that. And I said, once I've done all this, I'm going to give it a wash out, a regenerate. I'm going to try a bit of caustic soda. Because, say, the. Look at that. I bet that thing's solid in there, that pickup. So I'm gonna take that zip tie off, see there, cut that off, pull that bag off and give it a good wash out. See, look at all that. I bet it's blocked in that bag. Right. <coughs> As I said before, I need to cut that zip tie off to get some cutters. Like that. sediment in there which would prevent some of it. Um, looks fairly good actually. Yeah. Anyway I've cleared it. There is some sediment. Dirty sediment in there. Yeah just you got I've cleaned the bag out. There it is. Got a new zip tie, and that just pokes through there, and then you just zip it up around the neck, and then cut the end off. That's all. I bought that. It's about a pound or something like that for a kilogram. I'm gonna put, I don't know, half a cup full in there. 
and put, fill the tank up with water and regenerate, see what happens. Before I need to, um, I need to turn the thing back on again. It's a bypass valve. When I turn that, then it'll run through the hard into the system and then out into the soft. So let's turn that on. Here we go. Turn the valve. Right, that's on now. And now I'm going to press the regenerate button. As you can see, I filled up the tank with water and that caustic soda. Bit of an experiment, right? Regenerate. Right, that's now fired up. So hopefully, it's suck anything up. It's sucking stuff up. Um, don't know, see what happens. I'll, I'm going to regenerate it probably about four or five times. Keep filling it up with a little bit of caustic soda and then wash it through the water. So hopefully that will uh, pressure then will come out in the shower and clear the system. Now if it won't, uh, I've done it twice now, regenerated. If it don't regenerate with the regenerate button, just flick off the power like a power cut and then that regenerates. For some reason that ain't working, so off with the power. On again, resets. I mean, the only thing is you have to reprogram it after with the times and everything like that, but at least it's regenerating, that's all. Clear the system out. I've actually flushed it now about a dozen times and it's a vast improvement as um, whereas before there was hardly anything coming out of the tap hot or cold because everything runs through here um, now it's it's flowing normally I'd say it's a success 